You know, I'd say number one, we uh, we try to p practice a great pace. Be physical with them. Be physical with them, Mike, just like that. We don't want any dead time, you know, going from one drill to the next, just like it is in a game. We got to play high major big boy basketball against these guys. Everything we do is competitive. We got a lot of drills. It's like charges, diving on 50-50 balls, rebounding, a lot of toughness type drills. <laughs> He's country strong, man. Energy is throughout the practice. You got to have energy or else the practice ain't going to go well. Two hands, two hands. We got to play above the rim. We go hard. Uh, just every day we're competing. Just trying to be, trying to just get better. He can be a yeller. Hands, 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 hands. And he can also be a teacher. It's kind of, kind of a combination of both. You got to go high hands to a handover. Just to be ready to contest. Now he's getting this point across and like sometimes we lack off in practice, and then once he yells at us, we regroup and get it back going. I think there is a balance between, hey, going hard, competing, and teaching. You know, I don't want it to be a coaching clinic, but again, at the same time, you gotta be able to make big points to the whole group. I want a dunking mentality around the rim. Good, good tie. And then obviously, individual points on the side to certain guys. Miles, Miles, next time cut underneath the defender's rear end. I just want to consistently get better every day. Yes, yes, one, two, three. Just us.